and today we're going to be exploring and looking out for bugs because it was rainy yesterday and cold. So now I think bugs might come out and there might be some in my front yard. So we're going to look around and it's a beautiful sunny day with some cool breeze. You might hear some sounds like my dog, my pets, um, my little brothers playing. So yeah. So let's start looking. Let's look over here. Let me check. Hmm, no bugs around here. Let's check over here. Maybe. Let's check who they eat or do the bugs. Hmm, no bugs here. Let me check over here. Not, not the bug here. here. Oh, look. Guys, look. Look. That beetle. I don't think it's alive though. It's alive. It's alive. Move. Move, little brothers. My little brothers might have interests in bugs and say, you know, love animals. It's clinged on tight to there. I'm trying to pick it up with a spoon and put him in this tray. I have to be careful. So how do we pick it up? A bug and not can fly, Didi. Didi, not a bug not can fly. Look at the bone and go and actually he cut to me. Holy. He's moving, he's alive. It moving. Yeah. It moving. Be gentle. Look at that. It looks like a beetle. Yeah, it does. Not sure though. It turned into a beetle pill down. Might be a beetle. We pounded bug. We pounded it. Yeah. That's my spot. one of my little brothers talking. Mom's helping me out trying to get the beetle. So she's going to try to get it for me. Here, put it in this tray. Look, look, look. It's fine. Let's put it in there. The tray, the tray. Look at that beetle in the tray. We're going to find more bugs and put them in the, put them in the same tray. Good bug. Wait, that's not a bug. Let's look for some other places. Okay? There's a bug. It's fine. He'll flip himself over. Let me find more bugs. Come on. I'll hold the tray. Did he count it? Look at this bug. Right there. Right there. Look, look. I'm going to try to flip him up. Look. Flip him up. Look. He's alive. You know. A bug that can fly. Now let's look for more bugs. Let's get some more bugs. Find more. Here. With him there, so it's safe. And now I'm gonna hunt for more bugs around the, the garden. Let's find more bugs. See here. So let's go over here to this wet place because there may be some more bugs there, like worms and ants and mosquitoes. So I'll put him down here to make sure that I don't drop him while I'm going there because it could get a little slippery. Look over here. It's fine here. There's no bugs over here. I think I see one. Nope. That's still what you need. No bugs here. Let's look over here. Carefully. And this one. No. Just a part of a leaf. That's funny. Let's look at the mud. There might be some worms. Nope. some bugs over here no let's look over here you guys i found fire ants 
these ants but can sting you with their antennas. The sting hurts, but they do it to protect themselves. That's why people often like to just step on them when they see it because they don't want themselves to get stinged. See? Let me do some more. Some more can come out. Look. Cool. Yeah, so cool. All those fire ants. They're going in their little grotto. Maybe I should dig it a bit more, like here. No, maybe over here. Yeah, that gets out worse. And we can see those tunnels that they built in their house. The burrows. Yeah, they're called burrows. They're just like bunny tunnels, except they're way smaller because they're fire ants. There's a whole colony of them. A fire ant family is called a colony. All those fire ants, the queen of fire ants, those fire ants are the queen's children. They work for the queen so that they can get more brothers and sisters. Now it's time for more bugs. How about we just go right over here? Let's be careful. Hmm. Dig in this mud, because worms live in mud. You have to dig to find worms. Hmm. No worms. Think I see something? Nope. Just a stone. Let's dig some more, just to see. No Look what I found. Found. But that doesn't really matter. Let's go over here. I'll go over here. Get down from right here. This way. Careful. It's steep. Let's go over here. You guys, look. I found a ladybug. An orange ladybug. Ladyg ladybugs can come in three colors. Red, yellow, or orange. My mom's going to try to catch it while I bring the tray. You guys, I'm back and I got the tray. The mom plopped the bee, the ladybug in here. The beetle's right there, still digging. It is digging. It's oh, coming it's out. Running out. I'll put this down, and you can watch the beetle running. Beetle, it's digging. No, no. It's running out. It's running out. It's running out. Look at the beetle. The beetle digging. No beetle digging. Oh, ladybug. Oh, it's under. You can see a little. Oh, it's right oh, there. It's, it's out. Oh, look how smart the beetle was. Food container. Yeah, we do. For the beetle, for the ladybug. But for now, let's keep you. She's climbing back up. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Oh, ladybug, it built it. The ladybug, it built Oh, it built it. Let's see if the ladybug can manage to make it out for sometimes. We're not going to catch the ladybug. You might have heard my pet Juno, the, the dog. He's actually a puppy bark. Even though he's big, he's big because he's a German Shepherd. German Shepherds are big even when they're puppies. He's just a puppy German Shepherd. He's only a few months old. He's a protective dog, so he protects all the rest of our animals. You might have heard him bark about the ladybug or bark about any other bugs. Bye now.
hope you come soon and see more of my videos. Hope you subscribe and hit the bell button so you get notified when I make any new videos. Okay? Bye! If this video gets to 4 a million likes, I will make another video that will be outside. Bye now! Thank you.